all of the linkedin details as well in the description box below guys remember to share this opportunity i really wish i had this when i was growing up i really wish i knew about this when i was in when i was 16 years old i wish i really wish this was in existence when i was 16 years old that's why i'm super pumped for the current generation guys you don't need to miss this opportunity make sure to share this video share this video with every young african girl you know hi guys welcome back to my channel Mia moves here and thank you guys so much for clicking on this video long time no sit down video i really appreciate all of the engagement that i've gotten on all of my short form content guys if you are not following me on all other social media platforms please do well to follow me on linkedin Mia moves um it's quite easy to repost opportunities over there and follow me on tiktok follow me on facebook and follow me on twitter and most importantly follow me on instagram for my daily up to date and to know what i'm getting up to guys this is a video i'm making based off of a resource i bought on by chance and i'm gonna encourage you guys to please watch out and listen through the end of the video i'm gonna be looking down because i'm looking at the screen but all of the details are gonna be scrolling up here so you can actually see for in real time what's happening guys ramadan mubarak to all of my muslim brothers and sisters all over the world observing the ramadan fast and also happy belated international women's month this is very very important to me and i really thank you guys for all of the birthday wishes that you sent me guys in today's video like i already said i'm going to be talking about african science academy this video i'll be giving a special shout out to my friend Nene. my very first in uh, my very first youtube video was a collaboration between me and Nene, where we talked about application grad school application i'm going to be linking it i'm going to be linking it up in the card here so you go watch my very first youtube video and tell me what's the difference between that video um, in the pandemic period and now Nene, thank you so much for sharing this opportunity with me and in today's video like i said i'm going to be talking about the african science academy this is very important to me because when i realized and i had a conversation with her permission for me to share this with my subscribers because she personally has experience with one of our mentees with whom she helped um, with whom she helped through the process and has successfully gotten in. So the African Success Academy is a private not-for-profit school that was founded in the UK in 2016 by a UK-based charity, the African Gifted Foundation. And its sole purpose is to provide brilliant young African women with world-class STEM education. Guys, when you hear STEM, when you hear women, when you hear Africa, i'm there so guys i couldn't help but jump on the opportunity talk about this with every single african girl child out there that is in need of mentorship and is in need of a platform that would pedestal them to greater heights right? so guys if this is the kind of content you like to hear please do well to share this with your friends with your whatsapp group chat because we need more representation right we need more people of color especially us from the african descent to represent us at the table so please do well to share this video and continue watching to hear more about this opportunity a lot of the um past recipients of this amazing academy being massacred scholars mandela scholars um Ashesi scholars and um they all progress to various universities all around the world and uh, make their impact and achieve greater heights. The first step is an application process. The application is through the online portal or you can actually download the forms from the African Gifted website and fill the, the, the forms. Or you can also pick up a form from an African scholar, um, scholar academy volunteer. So those are the three ways at which you can apply. I'll be leaving all of the details in the description box. So please go ahead and check. Like I said, this is open to only females and it's open to high school leaders, right? So the application portal is an online way and i feel like it's the surest way for you to know your application is going to go through or you can actually pick up a physical form you can actually pick up an actual form from a volunteer or you can download the form fill it up and then send the forms to them and one of the essentials that you'll be needing for your application is a recent exam result six high school report cards and a teacher's recommendation the next step after the applications is your entrance examinations and selected applicants will sit through an entrance examination in their home countries and regions under the supervision of 
the ASA volunteers, right? And then applicants are expected to submit an essay on the day of the exam. You need to keep in mind that exams consist of the math aptitude test, physics aptitude test, essay topics will be communicated the day before the exam. And then the final step is to go through your interview. Shortlisted applicants are interviewed by the ASA team in order to know more about the applicants. And then some of the interview types include a face-to-face -face interview with Ghanaian students or video interviews from with applicants from other African countries. So you need to make sure you have a stable internet connection because I presume you have a Zoom interview if you are not in Ghana currently. So the admitted student will stay in the ASA, which is the Academy Building itself, which is located in Tema. And um, it's going to be um, a stay for 11 months where they will sharpen their academic skills and unravel their various talents. They have scholarship, which is 100% to cover your cost of attending the ASA and you'll be provided fully funded scholarships which is to co and cover up your 100% cost of, to attend ESA and your financial circumstances will not be a barrier to attending ASA if we select you. So remember that this is based in Ghana, based in Tema Community 6 and um, it is called the African Science Academy and um, the emails and all of the handles I will leave on the screen. And application pr process is actually, early decision is received 1st December, while the application, regular application deadline is 31st January. But I would say this is gonna be on a rolling basis because it's um, as soon as they get the quota that they need, then the application process stops. So guys, please make sure to follow all of the due instructions that I'll be leaving in the description box below. And remember that these are high school high school girls that are interested in a STEM career path. And they, according to what they say, is they welcome applications from girls all across Africa, typically age 16 years or older, who have completed their senior secondary school certification, IGCEE, IGCSEs, or all levels applicants must have a passion for math and science amongst the subjects studied at senior secondary school applicants will have achieved impressive grades in math and physics i'll be putting the pictures on the screen i'll be putting all of the details on the screen i am so excited for this opportunity i am so pumped up guys remember to follow me on linkedin and i'll be leaving all of the linkedin details as well in the description box below Guys, remember to share this opportunity. I really wish I had this when I was growing up. I really wish I knew about this when I was in when I was 16 years old. I really wish someone had, you know, told me about this. I really wish this was in existence when I was 16 years old. That's why I'm super pumped for the current generation. Guys, you don't need to miss this opportunity. Make sure to share this video. Share this video with every young African girl you know. Rise by lifting each other up. Guys, remember to share this video. And as you can tell, I'm super excited. And I would catch you in my next video, guys. Bye.